Well, I ride. <laughs> Mr. Hood. Miss Carrie. Hey, everybody. Welcome back to Kitty Speaks. It is Sandra, a.k.a. Kitty. I'm here today with another edition. Today is... I don't know what day of the week it is. If it's Thursday, it's Thursday, August 27th. Um, I got myself a little calendar right here, but I always do this to look behind me, and I'm going to try to get out of that habit. Um, I'm just going to be completely transparent with y'all, and the reason why is because I have these awful scars on the back of my neck that um look like nappy look like a nappy kitchen <laughs> and I got it from this product this completely bare I got this one month and I don't know if it was in a glam bag or if it was in a birch box or if it was in um the Allure Sample Society now called Beauty Box I think it's called um but what this is, is a waxing system that is completely self-contained. You're supposed to like rub these little strips in between your hands and the wax will heat up and then you put, put it on. Well, I got the brilliant idea that because I'm always feeling like a grizzly bear because I take biotin every month and it makes hair grow everywhere. So I always have like hair growing all down the back of my neck and I absolutely hate that so one day I got the brilliant idea that I would try these wax strips out on the back of my neck well the resulting <laughs> pain redness scarring like it was red and tender for like at least a couple weeks it was really really awful um everything like I couldn't stand to have anything touching the back of my neck it, it was just really really awful well now I have these scars on the back of my neck that have not gone away and this has been probably like five months ago it's August now so this was like in the spring I'm pretty sure um anyway every time I turn around and I'm editing my video and I see that I feel the need to explain what it is every single time like it's a mental thing yeah so anyway speaking of Vanity Fair um the little calendar that I have here to my right is from Vanity Fair I recently went ahead and added that to my um I think they're a Conde Nast publication if I'm not mistaken um I subscribe to a ton of Condé Nast magazines and I'm not sure if Vanity Fair is one of them or not but anyway I recently subscribed and my free gift with my paid subscription was this bag and this bag just came today um, I got it out of the mailbox like an hour ago I have been cleaning in my room like a fiend and organizing things and throwing things out and sanitizing things and um so I'm finally gonna call it quits for the day and now I can't because I've decided that this bag is going to be my go bag for clients um I because of my health I can't have anything that's really really heavy and I was thinking for the longest time about getting a roll cart but I think that that if I had something large it would just make me want to carry way more product than I would really actually need so this is going to make me have to be streamlined because I'm going to carry this and it can't be too heavy um but I love this bag it just has so many pockets it's like it doesn't have any pockets on the inside but it has a ton of pockets on the outside and um these zipper pockets and they're pretty large and I am like over the moon about this bag because I have actually been in the market for a um, something to carry my products with me when I go I generally don't do a lot of clients away from my home for that reason 
um, because of my health and my inability to be able to have to like t tote a lot of things with me. I don't do a lot of clients outside of my home. If you can come to my studio, that's wonderful. And if you can't, I generally kind of turn down anything that would make me have to be outside of the home. But um, but if I am able to limit myself and be streamlined and have this one little bag, um, Kitty Speaks will be coming to me you so that is all that I have for you today I just wanted to share that with you guys um basically just touching base because I don't really have anything else but you know in the interest of being transparent and letting you have a peek into my life I thought I'd make this little video so as always you know the drill love peace and angry well all right <laughs> Mr. Hood Miss Carrie you ready? Hold up. Let up. Hey Cinderella, is that your maiden name? I bet you if I spoke with Gorgeous, he would say the same. Swagger so insane, psychiatric thing. Where you from and what's your name? I'm wondering.